Hey everyone, the Midsummer Island Adventure event is here, and it's about time you learn the ropes around it. The event will last from June 9 until June 28, 2021. In order to join the event, you must be at least on Adventure Rank 21 and completed the Arkan Quest, Song of the Dragon and Freedom, and Klee's Story Quest, True Treasure. You can play the first part of the event right now. Part 2 will start on June 11, Part 3 on June 14, and Part 4 on June 17. The notable reward that you can get from the first part of the event are 90 Primo Gems, Crown of Insight, a Northlander Billet Trove, and a Tree Furniture Blueprints. After the fourth part opens, you can get Dodo Hotels and its refinement materials, Fragments of Innocence. Then, you can get three more Furniture Blueprints. For this part of the event, go to the Wave Rider Waypoint to summon the Wave Rider boat. Then, go to the monster encampments on the sea that are marked on your map. Use the Wave Rider weapons to destroy small towers and barricades. Your normal attack will shoot a projectile with 1 second cooldown, and your elemental skill will loop an explosive barrel with 15 seconds cooldown. Be careful of the whirlpools around you, as they can heavily damage your Wave Rider. The monsters are also fighting back. The Wave Rider can repair itself during and after combat for a small amount of health. Hop in again to restore for a big amount. In a pinch, use Wave Rider Repair Kit that you get from completing an even challenge. It can immediately restore 50% health with 90 seconds cooldown. After the rubble has been cleared, get out of your boat and defeat the rest of the enemies yourself. Completing this will give you a shiny float sams that can be exchanged at the event store. Alright, you have learned the basics, now it's time for you to do it smarter. Here are our tips for the event. Tips number 1. You don't have to destroy all barricades. Simply destroy enough so it doesn't get in your way. Tips number 2. You can lob your explosive barrel to destroy the weed barrier. Defeating the animal shaman turtles will also dispel it. Tips number 3. Don't have enough damage? Just knock back the enemies to the sea. Use heavy hitting attacks like charge attack. Tips number 4. Destroying the small towers will break the bridge connected to it. The enemies above it will fall and drown. Tips number 5. You will only need 2000 shiny flotsam to buy all rewards at the store. All the challenges can be done by the time you reach that amount. That's all for this part of the event folks. Enjoy the summer and look forward for the next part.